Here is how to build a Python file organizer with a simple GUI that cleans up your entire file mess in one click. We start by importing tkinter for the GUI and the OS and Shutil libraries. We create our main window using tk.tk, set the title to file organizer with a folder emoji and size it to 400 by 250 pixels. We configure the background to pure black. So next, we need a way to call for action. We create a string var starting with ready to organize. We put this inside a label widget with a dark gray background and that signature bright cyan text, 0ff. We use bold Arial font size 16, so the status updates look crisp and modern against the dark theme. Here is the business logic of the program. We define a dictionary called types. This maps folder names, like images, docs, and videos, and so on to the file extensions used for them. And then we create the organize files function. When triggered, it opens a system dialog asking you to pick a folder you want to organize. Here we add a counter to see how many files were moved. So now let's look at this loop closely because this is where the actual work happens. We start by grabbing every file in the folder. But first, we do a quick sanity check. If the file name doesn't have a dot, we continue or skip it. So next, we need to get the extension. With the os.path.splitext, we split the name and grab the file extension like .py. Now we iterate through our categories. If we find a match, we set the target folder. And actually, this next line is key. We check if not os.path.exists and use os.makeDurs to create it. So finally, shuttle.move takes the file and physically drops it into the new folder. We increment the counter, break the loop, since we're done with that file, and update the text on the screen. Okay, now let's build the UI. We first add a modern looking button using a label for more control. So, we create a frame and inside it, we use a label widget acting as a button. We color it a vibrant flat orange with white text. It's 20 units wide and uses bold font. We bind the button click event to our function. This gives us a responsive button without a white flashing and no borders. Finally, we add a small footer text and run the main loop. Run this code and watch the magic. Click select folder, pick a messy directory and boom. Instantly, all your images, documents and videos are sorted into neat folders. The display shows the progress. I don't know what you can use it for, but I like that Python can do it. Happy coding, and I see you in the next one.